guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks. I don't even know what day it is, how I'm vlogging. I actually lost my battery for like three days. Now I found it, so I've been vlogging on my phone. And I'm in California still. I'm going to the beach today. I just have on these cute loose jeans, a little bathing suit top, and a pink laser thing just for some color. Um, I'm here with my friends. It's like our last day. We're gonna um, do some things after. I'm going to the beach. It's been so fun. I don't want to leave. I definitely think I'm gonna move out here for a little bit because I'm just like like it. Yeah, but right now I'm just had breakfast. We all just kind of hung out, had some coffee. Then they're gonna go get breakfast. I'm gonna go to the beach, and yeah, that's the plan. Party! <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> channel what's up my name is Vanessa if you guys are new here hi um so little change of scenery we are in my cousin's house at California I feel like I have not talked to you guys in like a while about anything or like where I am 
um, but essentially I came to California with a couple friends I might have described it in my latest videos but all of that and now I am staying with my family because I'm here for an extra week I have all online classes so um, I don't really have any rush to go home essentially like all of my classes are home I hurt my knee so I'm not even playing soccer right now so I just was like why not just take the time and stay here with my family in the nicer weather um, and yeah so that's what I'm doing and I'm so excited because I feel like hanging out with all my f new friends and things like that was so amazing and I'm so grateful that I met such close friends in the matter of like two weeks but um somebody is coming and I feel weird um but this week I am just gonna focus more on school and kind of like reeling myself back in a little bit because I'm staying with family so I'm just gonna be like lounging not like you know visiting as many places so yeah and that's just like the little rundown but today is Tuesday morning I'm like forgetting the days they're all like blurring in <laughs> um and yeah I think I'm gonna go to a coffee shop today I have to get some work done oh my god I have a stain on this sweatshirt is like you guys are gonna be like what I got soy sauce all over myself when we went out to dinner one night <laughs> um but yeah so I'm gonna go get breakfast I might go for a little walk if you guys want a knee update we can bend it almost all the way so that's a plus um <laughs> it's like so hard to like i don't know for me i'm just so active so i just feel a little bit like set back but i mean whatever it's fine it's getting better and i'm gonna just have to go to the doctors when i get home but besides that i'm gonna go to a coffee shop i have some stuff to get done i really have to get like so much editing done i feel like i have a lot on my plate right now but um i'm just like embracing it all and i'm in california so i cannot complain the weather here is like beautiful i'm probably gonna go maybe like sit by the water some point later and i really want to just catch up on youtube and journal i haven't done that i feel like i've just been like go 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 and like i haven't been on my phone which is amazing because i've just been like building connections with people and things so um i think i just need to take the like a little break and yeah that's what i'm gonna do like disconnect but before that i really want to get all my homework done so get all the homework done and then focus on life <laughs> i guess so yeah okay um but yeah right now i'm just sipping my lemon water <laughs> the scrunchie so I put in some earrings cuz I haven't like gotten ready in the morning in a while I don't have any makeup on I don't like wearing makeup that much but I got some Sun on my face and I didn't even like mean to but um, yeah it like looks kind of good it looks kind of like blush on but really just sunburn <laughs> this is all my things just over here <laughs> um my school stuff yeah this is the little layout their place is so cute it's like adorable um but yeah so i've just been kind of like organizing myself and getting some things like that done i think right now i'm gonna finish my lemon water sit down and read i'll show you guys the book that i'm reading right now too and just like a couple of the things that I am reading. Do you guys uh you want to watch Peppa the Pig? <laughs> I have a baby cousin. She's two. And she likes Peppa the Pig. So cute. Um Okay. So I'm reading The Mind Connection by Joyce Myers. Oh, and I need a new camera. Mine is breaking, unfortunately. It's like falling off. The Mind Connection by Joyce Myers, such a good read. Really brings my mood up actually every time I read it. Mm, this is my little ladybug Bible. <laughs> Had it since I was like three. It was the only one that fit in my suitcase. Um, and then this, I've showed you guys so many times, but I've been really reading this every single morning because it's not long. It's 
probably takes like literally five minutes and yeah that's what I'm reading and then my five minute journal which you guys all know about which which I've actually slacked on slightly but that's okay I'm giving myself some grace um, I'll read you guys a quote the longer I live the more I observe that carrying around anger is the most debilitating to the person who hears it where is it I can't see bears it <laughs> that's so true yeah um, I actually just, actually, that really just, like, resonated with me for a second. I just want to touch upon that. Um, because even when my friends were here, we were talking about, you know, just, like, the life and, like, things that you go through. And, like, I think it's really important that, like, you guys build connections. Okay, I'm trying to say, like, build connections and also make sure that the people you're hanging around with are able to like get to that level with you because that is really important when you are calling these individuals your friends um i don't know how that relates to anger but now i'm just talking about friends but like if i've learned anything this whole two weeks that i've been here it's really just been like the genuineness of the people that I've been around and the way that they make me feel the way that they can make you feel it's like something that I never thought like before like I thought that I had friends like genuine friends and I it's sad to say like but I didn't like they just weren't and I was surrounded around people who weren't uplifting me and they didn't want the best for me and you know it's something that you kind of like learn I guess as you get older and it's not easy it's definitely like hard um but definitely like just being more aware of like who's around you is is something that can like absolutely change your life like a thousand percent I think um for me though I went through a state of loneliness like I walked through something that was really hard that only me and God could kind of take ourself take myself out of and like that's just part of my walk and I feel like I don't open up enough here on YouTube because it's like vulnerable and then like you see all sides of things but also besides that like not everything on social media is as it seems like I'm in California and it's like beautiful and I'm having fun and I'm posting pictures but there's obviously downsides to everything and I don't want people to think that just because I'm posting a picture in California that I'm like living I don't know this most like lavish life yeah that's essentially a goal of mine I want to make money and I want to work hard and I'm on my way to that route but in the meantime it's not like you have to feel bad about the situation you're in or compare yourself to me or compare yourself to anyone but instead of that like kind of just maybe take into perspective like certain actions that the people you look up to do and like what are they doing are they like hanging around people who are like bringing them down and they don't want the best for them or are they hanging around like winning people are they hanging around like high motivated and highly driven people who want to succeed and who want to help them succeed are your friends showing your business that you're doing like are, is the friend that you have right now your best friend is she or he like gas you up like do they post you on their stories like those are little things that matter like do your friends want you to succeed as much as you do that's something you really have to think about that's something I never did for a really long time because I like to see the best in people and it doesn't mean that people aren't good like all these girls that I used to be friends with are amazing people like genuinely such nice people like but they just some just sometimes when you're moving at a faster pace than people they don't like that and they don't want to be around that and then things happen because of that and it can be look like it can be put on you and it looks like it's you and it's it can get messy but you just have to stay in your lane and keep doing you and I promise you'll find people who do want to be around you and they'll be around you because they love you and like they like who you are they'll accept you and they're just gonna like 
literally want to see you succeed. Your success does not take away from somebody else's. That's all I have to say. I'll, I'll end my little tangent on that. My arm's literally gonna fall off too. But yeah, that's just so true. Like, maybe like from here on out, I feel like it's important for me if anyone's listening, if you even care, it's whatever. But I'm just putting it out there that like, also practice on being like a good friend. Like, be the friend that you would like want to have. Like. And then they're just like you'll attract it like just be that type of friend that you want pray about it like maybe sometimes you have a different journey because you have to like go through it in order to help somebody else like who knows who knows your story but um yeah that's a little rundown but whatever besides that i am reading my books drinking my lemon water and then i think i'm gonna go journal and get some breakfast this is super strange, but I wanted to show you guys this perfume. Or it could be any perfume. But I've been so into, like, my, like, aura, the, like, surrounding of me, like, the smells and things. Like, I've always been like that. But um, something I've been doing lately is buying a, like, a Febreze or some sort of good-smelling scent and for some reason that really uplifts my mood and it like kind of does something i think it might do something to your brain i don't know but for me right now as i've been on vacation i took this perfume with me i've just been spraying it on like in the morning like kind of right when i wake up i know it sounds weird um but it's just like a familiar scent to me and i think it's really been like helping my mood i don't know that sounds so weird but like maybe you guys can relate <laughs> i'm just making some breakfast I was gonna go to, well I still am, I'm gonna go to a coffee shop, but I thought I would make some eggs first with some toast. Um, this is like my little go-to, and I don't think they have kale, but sometimes I will add that if there is any... Do you remember? Oh, do you guys remember? Okay, I put a TikTok up of this homeless man that I met. His name was Tom. And then I kept in touch with one of the guys who was an evangelist who I met. And he sent me this video of somebody so much. singing with him. Oh, no, you, you have a beautiful voice. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you so much. What you oh. This is my breakfast. Just made some eggs. We have little bell peppers. These are so good. I love these. And some sourdough toast with some butter and everything but the bagel seasoning. I am calling an Uber right now. Let's see if we get one. That is one thing I have spent lots of money on. Um, but I'm debating on wearing. It's definitely gonna get warmer out after, so I'm probably gonna put this on under. Ooh, I have to be ready in one minute. Okay, I have to go. Putting on the shirt. Please don't. Wait till we don't have to wear these. Two. The roll is out. Let's see how far the Uber is. Four minutes. All right, I'm gonna walk down now so that I am not late. Please. I also get a lot of questions on my shoes. I don't know how much I can. <laughs> they are from Steve Madden. I'll link them down below. I just got them at a store when we were walking in California, so I don't know if they're any like, I don't think they're popular. I just liked them, so. All right, keys, bag, full of books. 
purse, camera, mask. Let's go. So this is the shirt on really quick. Just have on my Steve Madden sneakers that I just bought. I don't know where these are from. Boohoo, I think, maybe. Um, and then I have on this black shirt from Garage. Have on some jewelry. Um, I don't remember where those are from. These are from H&M, <laughs> I think. Scrunchie from Amazon. My hair was blown out at Dry Bar, but it's like the third day, so I just threw it up. Um, this is from this jeweler near my house. I forget the name of it. And then I forget where the one on the right is from. The ring. Um, Macy's. Got that for Christmas. This is from Madewell. These are the Cartier. But they're fake. Don't tell anyone. <laughs> Until I can afford a real one. And yeah, this is the outfit. Probably going to throw on a sweatshirt. Very chill. Coffee shop outfit. Let's go. Got my coffee. I got a oat milk cold brew latte. Just one espresso shot. Got oatmeal. Just doing my homework. And it is. 11.30. The vibes are high. Tell me that does not look like the best bowl. Mm-hmm. You choose this to vlog? <laughs> Say hi. I can't get away from her. No, I'm kidding. Your phone died, so you FaceTimed <laughs> Yeah, Yeah, exactly. I go, you, I go, she can't get away from me. My phone died. I FaceTimed you on my laptop. No, literally. You. You're the problem. I am, yeah. <laughs> Bear. Or a bird, or a beaver, or a pig, or a moose, or... <laughs> Almost, it's a skunk. Oh. Skunk. Say skunk. Sick. See. Bunny. Bunny. <laughs> Good job. I'm still doing homework. It's 8.14.